let's give these guys a leader with siege. We need to finish this quickly. Quickly. Welcome the Waldros Sarge. Yes, I'm very hyped for Hearts of Iron 4. Just waiting for these dudes to go away. They will. Yep. Let's try to take that back. We're almost capped in Diplo power, which sucks. Let's see if there is something we can convert. There isn't. Guess I'm gonna waste some diplomatic points. Better, the, the, better than the alternative, which is to take up. We're gonna, we are gonna take this re really, really quickly. I'm gonna keep up this uh, prioritized because very, very soon I'm gonna need diplomatic points. Much more than I didn't need admin. Let's see if, we can, if I can get rid of one, uh, yeah. Policy. Hey guys, come on, go. Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna colonize that, I guess. They seem to be afraid to go to Congo for some reason. That's an uh, over one and a half years of delay, almost two years of delay. Hmm. They're very low base tax, so this will convert really quickly. Okay, I'm gonna give it give them another chance. The objective this time is to achieve the one faith achievement. All one faith achievement requires that all provinces in the world are of uh, our faith. I don't like to be to waste points, but we have s some land of our culture here. Nope. I'm gonna keep wasting points. Oh well. I was not expecting this. They happily travel through these provinces. Why the hell they don't come here? We took, the, we took the capital back, let's get out of here, so the country won't collapse. 
at least not yet. Okay, these guys should now happily go here. And they will happily come here too, after we colonize these. Okay, let's at least do this. Forty nine. Here they go. Here we go. Nice. They convert these. I will be happy. Be even happier if they convert these two, but. This is fairly low base tax, so it won't take long to convert. Especially if we build some cathedrals there. We'll unlock cathedrals soon, so we are w good. Here they go, all of them back and forth. After the one faith, um, I think I'm gonna play Byzantium when the 1.16 comes out. I haven't decided yet, but I think that's what I'm gonna do. I want to form the Roman Empire, that's my objective. Yeah, Blood Mac 21. Um, I'm wasting diplomatic points. It's on purpose, because I can't do anything with them. It's an even bigger waste spending 738 points to tech up when I don't need that tech. You'll soon be 100% converted. So I can, I can then start converting the provinces to my culture. Manchu culture. Thank you for letting me know that the colonists arrived. Capital is gonna fall again, but now it does not matter. Unless, uh, of course, these dudes don't come here. Come on, don't be a pussy. <laughs> Maybe you can load the save in 1.16 and try to form the Roman Empire. What do you think, the new Caesar? Maybe we can play along if I actually go for Byzantium. Yep, a big rebel train says what exhaustion is going up. At this point I want twenty percent I want twenty what exhaustion. Pretty much Let's go to speed 5. The country is going to collapse soon. This is converted. The only things... <laughs> the only 
only thing left is really uh, Kong. Sixteen fifty one. I've been trying to convert the country for s over seventy years now. These guys don't make up uh, their minds. They come here, then go. They go back. Oh boy. Oh, okay. That's that's good to know. Sometimes the saves are compatible, other times they are not. Four hundred thousand troops in one province. Okay, this will make culture conversion much, much, much cheaper. Culture conversion uh, minus 20% along with the finisher, finisher of uh, religious ideas, minus 25%. If we combine that with the fish modifier that should be somewhere around here, there we go, minus 10% and um, on top of that, whatever number uh, we, whatever uh, number uh, those modifiers come up with, it's gonna be further modified. Oh, this guy is so garbage. It's gonna fo gonna go. F it's gonna be further modified by the adjacency. If um, the province we want to convert is adjacent to one of our own provinces uh, with the right culture, it's going to reduce the diplo cost by 25%. Okay, now all these dudes are going to, to um, Congo. I may have to take the capital. Prevent the collapse before they are actually able to siege these, we'll see. Okay, they're going there, so this is gonna be quick. Upa102 is asking why did you let it all rebel? Because I, they are gonna convert the country to animist. 90, we are, we are already 90.9% animist. I had to do it because animists uh, have very crappy missionary strength and they can have a maximum of two, of two missionaries. So without the help of rebels this is pretty much impossible to, to do. At least in 1.15. To the best of my knowledge, there is. It's kind of silly to say that something is impossible in U4 when um, uh, when sometimes we are surprised with things we think it's impossible due to some broken mechanic. I'm pretty sure a lot of people thought that one faith. With enemies, with the enemies' faith is impossible. I guess I'm gonna prove them wrong. Okay, I think um, we can sign a peace treaty. We are now 91.5% animist. Can sign the peace treaty. That uh, will break the country at the end of the month. Why animists and another kind of zealots with better... Uh, not sure what you mean, sorry. Okay, yeah, there we go. The game is frozen. Okay. 
Oh, he lost uh, 50 prestige. Some stab hit. We're now animist. And we can start converting stuff. Let's see if we grab a guy with conversion strength. Ah, uh, what else? That's pretty much it. We need to start converting provinces. Look, ship. So like I said, we have minus 25% due to fully religious, minus 20% due to culter, cultural unity, minus 10% of training in fish, and uh, this minus 55% modifier will be will be furthered, further modified by minus 25% due to adjacency. The, this minus 25% uh, culture adjacent by is works similar to the administrative efficiency. Yeah, but it's pretty cheap for provinces with low base with low development. The other ones with very high development won't are still very expensive and I won't have enough points unless I bite the bullet and release this give these cars back to the release the countries uh, raise the provinces and so on until I have all the points needed to do a one culture conversion one culture to convert the whole world but I'm not gonna do that it's too much work but it's possible. Okay, time to enforce religion in our in our uh, colonial nations. They have, they don't have a huge amount of provinces, so this might work. We we'll have over 150 years. Hopefully they will be able to convert all of these. It would save me the trouble to attack them. Some of them will probably declare war because they're stupid. Okay, let's see. We're losing lots of dosh. This should go away. I have one free merchant. Where can he put where can we put this dude? Okay, no one is, is steering here. Let's uh, let's go. Basically, now we need to go bit breaks. We need to go break some heads in a new world. And um, apparently, we also need to give more territory to the estates. Whatever, I just want to get rid of them. This will do. This free missionary is gonna go away at the end of the month. This missionary is from being uh, Hindu, uh, from Controlling Varanazi. We are not. We are not. Vara, we are not Hindu anymore. Anyone, if you're Hindu and you control this province, you'll have an extra, an extra missionary. The conquest of Varanazi. It's gonna go away at the end of this month.
So, no point. But thanks for um, letting me know. There we go. We lost the missionary. Still losing Dosh. We're spending 143 ducats in... Oh crap, I didn't want to do that actually. I want to grab... I want to grab the cathedral as soon as possible. Okay, let's go to the new world. This is obviously an overkill. We have plenty of troops, but just in case our colonial nations want to rebel, we can take another 56, so let's do it. They have better tech now, so we need more troops. Current force limits are 1200. I'm a little bit over half the force limit. It's gonna improve a lot as the... As the local autonomy goes down. Let's bring these guys. I guess we can bring them here first, whatever. Yeah, let's come here first. Missionary strength, dude. We still we still kept one modifier from Hindu, from uh, sorry, not from Hindu, but from Sikh. Saving the burning world. Everything else we lost, so we still need to enable a few decisions here. Ability at least one. Why animist asks you ask because it's easy to do a one faith with any other religion pretty much especially with with the Sunni or uh, any Ab Abrahamic faith is easy to do a one faith I don't recall every anyone doing a one faith as animist before so that was another um, incentive for me. Okay, let's try to go kill the Ottomans this time for good. You guys are stuck here. Because I didn't want to wait. Let's fire the troops near the Ottomans to, kill, to go kill them. The colonial nations, the colonial nations should have pretty high unrest. I'm gonna need to help them if I want them to succeed converting the provinces quickly, as quickly as they can. Let's convert some more stuff.
Welcome uh, to for 374. It's bugged. I can only convert these ones at a time. Ah, uh, this is. This one succeed. Yep, this is still ours. Now I can happily create colonial nations around the world because it's gonna have my culture, the Manchu culture, and uh, and faith. And the animist faith. Mm, let's leave some troops here to deal with those rebels. Enable a pop up. Mm -hmm. Gonna let me play faster and not lose efficiency. Crap. Yep, let's disable it for now. Because I'm I'm uh, recruiting troops beyond annoying. <laughs> Whenever we're recruiting troops. Hello Matt, welcome for the welcome and thanks for the compliment and They're all good players. You should watch them too if you if you have the time. Especially DDR Jake, but Arumba is also good in his own way. Okay, let's give these guys a leader. He's an overkill. I'm suffering attrition. If you don't uh, usually watch my... Okay, whenever a unit is locked like this, and you, fi you think you made a mistake, just... Grab the fleet, send it somewhere else, and uh, that will be it. I usually care with the attrition, not in this playthrough, because we are so powerful that this doesn't matter. So, if you see me playing very sloppy, that's why. Welcome Red Tank 95. Let's convert some some more provinces. Mm 